thank you for what you said about me. It wasn't necessary. It was true. I don't think I would have made a decision to run if it wasn't for you encouraging me. Other people were just encouraging. Yeah. But it was you that made me realize how much I wanted. That was you. a non-starter because um, what if you know Scotty Baldwin would turn down anything? Yeah, that's exactly what I thought too, but I did some research online and it turns out that Rick Lansing is an excellent lawyer and he has won a ton of cases. You think he's encouraging Heather to move forward with the frivolous lawsuit? As unconscionable as it may seem, yeah, I do. Curtis, Portia, hi. Thank you so much for being here and supporting me. It was so good looking on seeing you guys. It was absolutely our pleasure. Great speech, Thanks. You look absolutely at home in front of a crowd. You kidding me? I've never been more nervous in my life. I survived two plane crashes, so that says enough. And I gotta say to you, again, I know I keep saying this, but thank you so much for being there for me and for taking out all that extra work covering for me and the Laura Law that out campaign. It's been a challenge, but I gotta say, man, um, I love it. It shows. I'm amazed at what this guy's accomplished so far. Amazed, not surprised. I knew you were the right man for the job. Your manslaughter charge is absurd. In what universe is that a federal crime? Ms. Corinthos Davis has already been charged with the attempted murder of a federal witness. Any crime committed that can be attached to a federal crime can be attached to the original charges and tried in federal court. The baby died because Ava pushed her out of a window. Miss Jerome was defending herself against Christina's attack. That is not what happened. I keep telling you. You are not only out of your jurisdiction, you are out of your mind. You are also threatening the well-being of my client. I think that's abuse. If you're so concerned about your daughter, correction, the client, both know there's a way for you to make this go away. I have to take care of something. I will be right back. So you say nothing. You dare not say one word to my client without me being present. Sergeant. Ms. Davis, what can I do for you today? I am officially requesting that Cadet Heller stay with my daughter until I get back. And under no circumstances is Agent Cates to be left alone with her. Have you seen or spoken to Dante? No. Haven't you? Well, I talked to him the other day when we were transferring uh, a little bit to GH, and they hadn't, they didn't know what was wrong then. Do you know anything? Yeah. Uh, Lulu needs a liver transplant. Damn. Yeah. Nicholas was a match, Lulu was a baby. Dad and being Spencer's father is only two things he's done good in his life. Laura went to see Nicholas. Don't tell me he's refusing to help. No, he'd love to, but he's no longer a viable donor. I got tested and I'm not a match. I'll get tested. Now I haven't been able to reach Lucky. Laura is trying to track him down now. I'm just surprised that Dante hasn't reached out to you. Is everything okay with you guys? Carly, we just haven't talked since I was off my medication. Dante knows what happened, right? I mean, we can't hold that against you. Dante was focused on Lulu, and I was focused on Christina, and, you know, we just we didn't touch base. Well, clearly not knowing where you stand with each other is bothering you. Of course, there's no 